fragrance coach and fanatic. Thank you for coming. Thank you. What are colognes and fragrances made of? Fragrances are made of notes. Typical top notes would Ooh, be citrus. I just got a whiff of something syrupy. Did you get that? Maybe this. This one's amber. Oh yeah. What comes to your mind? It's like one of those stores where they sell like hippie clothes. See, I only, I'm going to smell Spencer's gifts. So, <laughs> so what kind of scent? Christmas. You, see, I'm Jewish, so I don't. Yeah, you don't get this. I don't scent. get it. Oh, it smells like a um. Uh, candy cane. Candy yes, cane. Yes. <laughs> okay, so we have three coworkers who could use a little bit of help in the scent departments. We were wondering if you could kind of give them little consultations and see what they like. I'd love to. Yay! Let's bring them in. So what do we got here? Well, what we've got here are individual notes mm -hmm. that are used to create perfume and then we've got some commercial scents and I want to figure out which one you like. I, I, don't, I don't know that I have a preference so I'm excited to find out which one I like myself. Do you like citrus and mint? I'm not, into mi I'm not so into mint but it's citrus I can do. I'd say citrus is probably my favorite kind of floor cleaner. Tell me what this reminds you of. Kind of like lavendery. Yeah. It smells a, like purple. Do you like it? That's my favorite one. I like that a lot. Cedar. So um, it's it's seeming like I'm going down the woody path. Well, you you could like a lot of different smells, but it seems like you are kind of a woody lover. This is a man's cologne, but it's a man's cologne that a woman might potentially steal. Is that licorice? That's licorice. Did you know that I have? Women, sure. Yeah. Women love the smell of licorice. This is a men's cologne that has anisette in it. No, I like that. One. Yeah, that was a good one. I'd wear that one. All right, try it on right now. Okay, now that Dan, Streeter, and Jeff have picked their scents, let's see how they do with real live human girls. Ooh. Ladies, there's no way I cannot sound creepy when I say this, but now we're gonna blindfold you. <laughs> good? Yeah, you were right. All right, ladies, we're gonna bring in our first subject. I would say he's, he smells like he showers a lot. I was gonna say he's very, it sounds it's very, it smells clean. very clean. So wrong. Someone who, would, uh, <laughs> someone who would take me out to a really expensive dinner. Oh, you guys have no idea what you just <laughs> said. I got woodsy. Woodsy. Yeah. Kind of old Out, man. Outdoorsy. I didn't get like old man. I got like he could like punch a bear in a neck. Manly and like a lumberjack. Yeah. Very strong. And now for our third subject. I really like that one the best. I really like it. Yeah. <laughs> but it reminds me of something that he would have found in a magazine and then like rubbed it. <laughs> yeah. It was like a little bit sweet. Yeah. It was, it like was I feel like we would spoon. Borderline feminine for me, but. Okay, so now that you guys smelled all three of the guys' scents, which scent was your favorite? I think I have to go with number three. Number three? I like that one. Anna? The first one. The first one? I like the second one. Uh oh. Whoa. <laughs> one boy for each of you. This is yes. perfect. Well, sir, it looks like it was a happy ending for everyone. Yep. Thanks for coming to College Humor Labs, and we'll see you next time.